Welcome to Rue Centre Dine Market. It's one of Germany's biggest supermarkets, so let's get inside and see what we can find. Hello everyone, welcome to Shopping Vlogs here on Food Review UK. Yeah, Rue Centre. It's the big version of Rue. We, now we went in a Rue yesterday and it was pretty decent. Hoping to find loads of awesome stuff in here. Let's go. Okay, so here we go. I think this is the first, or at least rather, I should say the, yeah, let's get a basket, Claire. Okay, so here we go. This is Rue Centre. So this is a large version of Rue. We did, Claire and I did go in a Rue, I think yesterday, but it was a very small one. So this is uh, probably the biggest German supermarket I've ever been in. So hopefully, We'll find some good stuff. So far this trip, which by the way, you can check out all our antics on Theme Park Life. Oh, they've got a bakery, but yes. Um, but so far on this trip, we found some really interesting stuff in German supermarkets, like bubblegum flavor iced tea and cotton candy slash candy shop flavor iced tea. And we're definitely gonna get some refrigerated drinks, not only for tonight, because we're quite hot, it's been quite a hot day. We've been at Fantasia Land. Uh, we've had a lot of fun. Uh, but anyway, not only is it a really hot day, We've also got a very long journey tomorrow, so it'd be nice to have some refrigerated drinks for then. Oh, these donuts look so cute. There's like a baby blue one and a... Uh, oh, it's got like smarty pieces on. That looks quite cool, actually. <gasps> oh, yes, cheese. Yep, yep, yep. I was hoping they would... I was hoping they would have a cheese pretzel. Cheese pretzel. Awesome. Yeah, it's our last day in... Well, we're leaving tomorrow, but... Yeah, get a few of these. 29 euro, 29 cents plus is our last day in Germany today. And we, as I say, we're driving home tomorrow, but we're leaving at like 6 a.m. And we were determined to get a pretzel, weren't we, Claire? Yeah. So yeah, I'm really glad they got a cheese one. We've got a bratwurst and we want a pizza. Yeah, we've had a bratwurst, didn't we? Right. Getting a few of them as well. Get one or two? Yeah, two's fine. I mean, at 30 cents, might as well. They've got a pretzel roll. Pretzel roll as well, if we want like a classic hamburger experience. Oh, I don't know, I think the texture is really interesting on this. Sort of want to try it. Oh, here we go, loads of cereal here. Oh, look at this mini apple crush. Cine minis. Cine minis apple crush. Oh, what's that, Claire? Cookie crisp. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate toast. toasts. Oh my god. Interesting. I'm so. Yeah, Claire, look, this, we went on this ride. Yeah, and we got absolutely soaked. That base, that way worse than that happened to us. <laughs> we got completely soaked. So Claire and I, our bottom halves are currently sort of drenched. Now we dried off a little bit, but we are still very wet, yeah. Chocolate toasts, I'm intrigued, Claire. Should we grab them? Are you intrigued? I'm intrigued. Yeah, I'm intrigued. Oh, they've got hazelnut. Oh. Oh yeah, look at that. Do you think it? Re do you think it re? Do you think it rebranded? Bloody hell! That's that's that Claire. That was like a proper Sherlock Holmes mystery. Oh, chocolate now. Oh, well, let's get cookie crisp. I cause it get cookie crisp. I'd say because I prefer the branding. Although this is Nestle, it is still Nestle. Oh. No, yeah, get cookie crisp. I think. Right, that was a bit of an ordeal. We went and got a, a trolley. We, first of all, we couldn't leave because it's no entry. And then uh, then I went and we didn't, I didn't have a coin, so I had to come back and we had to ferry some coins between us. Anyway, we've got it sorted now. Let's go back to where we were. Yeah, I am intrigued by these apple crush. So I guess cin cinnamon and apple filled thingamie bobs. Banana pillow things. We've got them in the UK, actually. Oh, they've got the choco roulette here as well. Do we have these? No, we don't have cho we don't have those. No. Interesting. There's choco curls. Oh, mega box. Yeah, I mean, go for it, Claire. When in Rome, Smacks as well. Kellogg's Smacks. Oh, what's this brand? Look at this, Claire. Choco Vol. What is that? Like mini biscuits. Zwinnies. I wish I knew. I wish I knew what flavours were. <laughs> this this got a happy little chap on it, isn't it? Well, Look at these. Oh, there's a coconut one. Coco oh, you think that's, yeah, double choc. That's, uh, Choco like vol choc volico. Oh, I see. Yeah, wheat and chocolate. Cereal. It's new. Why is that a big deal? This is like dark chocolate. Dark chocolate, yeah. 
Yeah. Swinnies. Okay. I'm vaguely intrigued by this. I mean, it does just look like a little bit like digestives, but I am intrigued. I'm, do you know what? I'm going to get the... Oh, wait, what's this? Vol Milk Choco. Milk. Oh, so this one's wheat and oh, right, that's sweetie. Let's get a double. Chocolate. It just—it looks like it's quite good brand. It's the branding that's done it for me, Claire. Let's get the double, the double chalk. What have we got here? Cold tea, sparkling. Cold tea, sparkling. Hmm. I'm not sure what the flavour is. Orange and ginger, lemon, and then whatever this is. I might try this one. Cappuccino with milk. Oh, that's nice. Oh, they've got little sachets. That's good. Oh, Jacobs. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's the one that we had. Yeah, Claire had one of these coffees this morning. It was absolutely delicious. Yeah, it was these, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm going to get this. It was just a, like a really nice... Yeah, I'm actually going to get that. It's just a really nice coffee. I'm tempted by this caramel now, Claire. No, we'll definitely get this because I had one this morning. I thought it was delicious. What's that? What is that? Like grapefruit. Got a mint one. How'd you do it? I don't know. Get the Google let's get the Google lens out. What's that? Mint chop? Wow, yeah. that's cool. Yeah, let's get the Google lens on this, see how you make them. Oh geez, this place is massive. I didn't even realise how big it is. Christ. Oh yeah, different pie toppings. I don't know what that is. Whatever this is. Mandelm, Gal Galak, I don't nuts, I don't know. Cacao nibs. Ooh. Nuss nougat. Pistachio cream. Wow. Seemingly a new range of lint bars here. Like, sort of, they look like Sunday bars. I think I bought that banana split one a few days ago. Ooh. Nothing too new there, I don't think. Nuts, what have we got? Honey and salt. Nice. Hmm. Coated nuts, green power. Oh, you want dull? Oh, you want dill pickle? What we got in the crisps aisle? Oh, sour cream. That's a shame. Ooh, soft cookies. Iconic restaurant. We've got KFC, and yes, that is Jerry Halliwell that you're hearing. Uh, Subway. I bought them. Sour cream, plain salt and vinegar, garlic paprika. Butter, I think it's garlic. Oh, garlic butter, that's quite interesting. Yeah, krauter butter. Wow, that's pretty weird. Oh, look, they've got the mao, um, they've got the mao, so if I, um, let's just check what that is, yeah. If, uh, if we hadn't got them from mao M H Q, which I'm so sure you've seen the video, then I would have been very excited then. Although this is, oops, whoops, pop them back. What we got here? Smoothie style. Hmm. Reason caramel. 69 cents. Nine. Uh, yeah, just to satisfy it's just to satisfy my curiosity. Wow, this is a really good aisle. They've got loads of interesting candies. What do you thought Smoothie. Oh milkshake. Lemon. Oh are they really milkshake? Oh yeah, shakies. Lack gummy oh, shakies. How do you know that, Claire? That's smart, Jesus. Apple, strawberry is it? Hmm, interesting flavours. I really like the branding on these ones, these lac gummies. And they look, look at these really fun characters, looks a bit like me. Carabo Fruit Mania Joggurt. They do actually look nice. Got some Kinder stuff. Oh, Ovaltine, what is it like? Is it like a biscuit bar? Schlocko Classica. That looks weird, doesn't it? I, don't, I can't even make out what it is. Oh, nuts, yeah, that looks like a Topic, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, that must be like Topic. I'm intrigued enough by that. That looks like a boost. I'm intrigued by that, I want to buy that. Oh, yeah, look, they've got Wonder Bar. A chocolatey Wonder Bar as well. There's a normal one there, and then a chocolatey one. I've not seen that chocolatey one before. Mm, Claire, I'm not sure about this Treats Company. You've seen this? Looks a bit like Reese's, yeah. doesn't it? Mm. Oh, what is that? Eh? Caramel, choco, and sea salt. Look at this coating. Yeah, nice. No, so. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like, like, I'm not being funny, like a salty caramel coating on peanuts, yeah. Oh, this is new. Noppers Dark, nice. Maribel Dime, King, uh, but <laughs> careful with that in the, in the sun, Claire, it'll take your eyes out. What's that? Toffee Trio, toffee, toffee trio. nice. 
Oh, this is that chocolate brand that they do in Aldi sometimes. Salted pretzel peanut butter. Hmm, sounds kind of excellent, but we do need to, we sort of, I, I know in an earlier video I probably said that we're not going to hold back whatsoever. I think we are getting to the point where we do need to hold back a little bit because it is getting slightly out of hand, I would say, but that's okay. We've still got a few, oh, oh, oh shit, shit, yeah, no, the hold, the holding back ceases, the holding back did not last long. No, the only thing that we need to bear in mind slightly is that we are still going to Belgium and probably a couple of more supermarkets tomorrow, so just need to be a little bit careful. Lots of different Ritter Sport, including, what is this, Mandel, is that almond and orange? It's quite unique. Ooh, nice. Oh yeah, summer edition, white chop coconut. Oh, that's quite, that's quite cool. Whoa, what the hell are these? Lint feet. No. Oh, madness. What is this? What is this, Claire? What is this, Claire? What is it? Yeah, 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 you do sort of need it. What is this? Fioretta. Well, I need the Mars. Yeah, you need that one. I need the Marzi pan. What's this one? What is that? It's a drink, isn't it? But I don't know. Yeah. Oh, love the look of them. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I'm, I'm going to hold back on that. They also do half baked, br half baked brownie. Oh, fucking hell, they do look good, don't they? Oh, that does look good, doesn't it, Claire? What do you think? No. Nice little collaboration between Heinz and Coca Cola here with some special edition ketchups, curry ketchup, and hot chili ketchup. That classic Mon Cherry, well look, they've also got guys. Mon Cherry Cherry Club Orange Fusion. Recently did a video about Ben and Jerry's around the world. Any interest in Hagen Dars? Is Hagen Dars German? You would sort of expect they might have some good ones, but I'm not really seeing any. I like the look of this bubblegum ice cream. You can get a feast, but it's called Nogga over there. Feast in a tub. Ah, feast in a tub, that's cool. Muller. Oh, look at that chocolate banana Muller. Quite a lot of milkshake type things here. Choco banana. So, oh, I've actually had that. Oh, yeah, I've actually, I was going to say, I've had that's the one flavour that I have had. Uh, I am tempted by banana co uh, chocolate though. Wow. They've even got rustlers in Germany. A big Soda Stream and Pepsi collaboration area here. Soda Stream Duo. Don't know what that is. Oh, maybe get two bottles or something. All your syrups. Oh, look at that, Mirinda syrup. Who's, oh, so, it, wait, is Mirinda PepsiCo? Oh, at least over here, Mirinda is PepsiCo. That's interesting. So I don't think I realized that Mirinda is, I assume, Pepsi's version of Fanta. Jim Beam iced tea, that's awesome. They've got so many different juices, like pink guava. Peach, yeah, passion, passion fruit, there you go, maracuja. Yeah, they're big on their passion fruit over here. A whole thing of passion fruit juice, that sounds bloody lovely. Where's the rhubarb? Where's the cloudy rhubarb? Oof. Christ. What we got here? What is this? What are you? What is this? I need to know what this is. Oh, is it just Lipton Sparkling Zero? Oh, I'm not it's interested in that. Sparkling yeah. Lemon Tea. Sparkling Zero, no thanks. What we've got down here? This looks interesting. This looks interesting. What is it? Sparkling... Oh, Sparkling Peach. I think we've got that, actually. What was that one? I think that's the watermelon. Mango and passion fruit. Oh, they've got sparkling in a big bottle. That's good. Oh, here we go. I probably put a photo on screen anyway, but here's that cotton candy or candy iced tea. Oh, no, I think that's all right. Yeah, we just got some mezzo mix, haven't we? They got What the Fanta. I did actually see a display earlier that was What the Fanta that we were going to circle back to. They got, they got the red and the blue, so that's the pineapple hibiscus, and that is the uh, dr uh, mango steen and dragon fruit. Oh, Coca Cola vanilla. Oh, there's the cans of mezzo mix. Oh, they got strawberry. I should, but by the way, guys, I should say mezzo mix is the Coca Cola. Uh, version of Coke mixed with Fanta, and there is a Pepsi version as well called Schwip Schwap. But yeah, quite big over here. But yeah, a few Fanta options exotic, strawberry, kiwi, orange, 
This one I bought yesterday is mango and dragon fruit. Yeah, nice. Oh, I thought that was a thing. I thought they were really new. No. I literally saw that and I thought that must be a thing. Vanilla Pepsi Max. Mate, that's a madness. Oh, we are. Yeah, yeah, one. Yeah, not in, not enough bags. Yeah, I've made a fatal error. Right, here's that What the Fanta display. I mean, at least... At least there's a bit of, like, imagery here to, to sort of indicate the different labels. In the UK, we didn't have any of this branding, which sort of said that, like, hey, consumers, there's three different labels. They just... Yeah. And I've already said this, so it's probably getting old, but... I specifically asked Coca-Cola Europe if it was the same and there's no way to tell on the packaging and they said no. So a bit annoying. Banana juice. Oh, cloudy. Minty melon. Minty melon. Vanilla passion. Oh, vanilla passion. So yeah, that's what you want for your uh, passion fruit, um, your porn star martinis, isn't it? One thing I do like about, oh, what's that? I was going to say, one thing I do like about coming abroad is that you can get like flavoured waters, which are obviously quite low in calories, so it's a good way to do it. Cre... Crezioni. I don't know what that is exactly. But yeah, we can splurge out on waters without feeling too bad, Claire, can't we? Hella Sunny Melon. Melon and Strawberry. I'm interested by that. Let's get that. Do you think we're going overboard? Considering we've how much we've already bought, oh, on so the, small. the whole I'm not joking. The whole video is going to be an, about an hour long, Claire. I'm going to be knackered doing that. You're going to have to do it. I think you're going to have to separate. I think you're going to have to separate it. I don't. We won't be able to. I'm just going to have to get it all done in one go. Whoa, mango and dragon fruit in a glass bottle. That's cool. Yeah, I've seen all this stuff here as well. So I think glass recycling is quite a big thing over here, which is obviously good to see. Oh, this is what we want, Claire. A nice refrigerated drink for the way home. What have we got? All right, I think we're nearly there, guys. Maybe just one quick look in this cabinet here. Got some newies. Nothing too interesting there. Oh, you've got your Yodas. Oh, they've got a fun... Aww. That Toy Story one looks fun, doesn't it? I don't know, I'm looking. Where am I looking? There. Oh, Let's yeah. open it up. Have a look at that one. Twister. Oh yeah, it's like a Buzz Lightyear, it's like a Buzz Lightyear rocket pop, that's cool. So let's put the, uh... oh you've sorted the trolley, cool, about 45 euros later, we did not hold back. Thank you for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this shopping vlog, let us know in the comments below what the most interesting products you thought we spotted were, and we'll see you next time, cheers.